In the intricate landscape of modern manufacturing, the ability to precisely update legacy designs is paramount. Imagine an industrial valve manufacturer who is tasked with upgrading and modifying one of its existing valve designs to suit a customer's new process line requirements. The manufacturer has recently changed to BricsCAD Mechanical and their legacy library has been created in AutoCAD Mechanical. The task, implement updates to cater to new process line requirements, crucial changes in components and improved tolerances, all without disrupting the current design workflow. A task made seamless by BricsCAD Mechanical V25. Let's start by opening an existing valve assembly AutoCAD Mechanical DWG file. The major physical component redesign in the valve assembly is the change from a one piece stem and disc to a separate stem and disc components, which are manufactured to a higher precision. These components are native to BricsCAD, but thanks to the interoperability with AutoCAD Mechanical DWGs, inserting and incorporating this into the legacy drawing is no problem. Updating the parts list is easy with the ability to create a part reference from an existing block. This makes Bloom annotations a straightforward process by simply using the AM Bloom tool. By opening our easy to use yet comprehensive part list manager, we can change individual component properties and this is automatically reflected in the existing parts list. Next, let's use our new feature for 2D finite element analysis, CAE Analyze 2D. Adding this 2D finite element analysis into the design process provides an early indication of any potential design flaws. By initiating the command and selecting the component for testing, you can set and change a variety of parameters. Adding supports and loads is made easy through the panel. Define the accuracy of your study with a variable mesh sizing option. The results panel summarizes the input values and output values from the test. The mesh visualization produces visual results for von Mises stress calculations and displacement. This preemptive detection reduces the time and costs associated with the development of physical prototypes, directly contributing to a more cost-effective design process. As per the new spec, we have to adjust the valve face-to-face -face and stem dimensions. We'll use the power dimensioning tool or PDIM, which has been enhanced for efficient operation and ease of use. It allows for accurate changes in dimensions, crucial for proper connection tolerances, thereby preventing flange mounting issues and potential stem failures or compatibility issues. With the new snap to distance feature of PDIM, it's even easier to keep your dimensions consistent. After updating the dimensions, rescaling often becomes necessary. The updated AM rescale feature in BricsCAD Mechanical V25 offers interactive rescaling, ensuring that the updated dimensions are accurately represented in the design. Now we switch to our valve disk DWG. Here's where we need to add surface roughness details. This is where the upgraded AM surface sim tool comes into play. It simplifies the addition of accurate surface roughness, essential to prevent seat wear or deformation due to excessive friction, thus ensuring a longer lifespan for the new valve seat material. BricsCAD Mechanical V25 is about providing practical solutions for 2D mechanical design needs. This approach minimizes failures in the service life of manufactured products like the valve and reduces overall manufacturing costs. For users transitioning from AutoCAD Mechanical, the process becomes simpler and less time consuming. Experience a familiar and efficient 2D drafting workflow with BricsCAD Mechanical V25. See what's new in BricsCAD Mechanical V25 and why choose BricsCAD Mechanical V25 for design optimization in these breakouts.